Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome to another video in Minecraft. In this video, I'll be teaching you how to open and download worlds slash maps in Minecraft. And it's for any version too, so that's really good. So all you have to do, you come to this website. There's a lot of other websites, but this is the biggest one and best one for downloading um, pretty much anything for Minecraft, or one of the best. For mods, I prefer 9minecraft.net, but for everything else, I'll come to here. So what you want to do, I'll put this link in the description though, it's just playing in minecraft.com. You want to click on projects. And, whoops, I just kind of eliminated that. Oops. <laughs> Alright, well, again, okay, you want to click on projects and not do what I did. But, once you click on projects, you'll get a bunch of projects here, and then all you want to do, you want to find the project you want. So say you want this one, and it'll tell you how much complete it is. So the maker of the map, it'll say 20% complete, so that's not really done. If you want a good quality map, you want to find one that's 100% complete. You could also filter by most popular, if you want to find a really nice map. This one, oh, look at this one, Imperial City. That's really nice. Cops and Robbers. So I'll just show you this one. So once you click on it, it shows you a little preview of the map and it shows you a bunch of photos too and a description here and all you have to do is click this button right here minecraft world save and then just download it it might say something else just whatever is here just that click download and once it's downloaded you want to download it i already downloaded one right here that i'll be installing for you guys so what you want to do wherever you downloaded it just drag it to your desktop and when you open it up um make sure if you see this as soon as you open it up from your desktop, you want to drag that whole folder in. But if you want to, if you see this as soon as, if you see a single folder as soon as you open it up, and once you click on that folder, all the contents inside, what you want to do, you want to drag this folder into your game. So I'll show you what I mean. So you want to find where your Minecraft um, directory is. So t the easiest way to do this um, is just go to Acer. And just type in um, dot Minecraft. Oops. The easiest way to do that is just type in dot Minecraft, and a bunch of search results will come up. And I'll show you what the dot Minecraft folder looks like. Okay. So this is what the folder will look like. It will be in users, your username for your PC, app data slash roaming. So what you want to do, um, if you're into mods and stuff, and if you're into Minecraft, and if you're into saving worlds, you want to drag this right onto your file explorer to, and pin it there so it's easier access. I already did that so it's right here for me. Now all you want to do is it's as easy as this. Once you're in the .minecraft directory just click saves and all of your saves will be in here. So it's just easy as opening up the file and dragging it in. And that's all it is. That is. You're done. So now I'll just show you what it looks like. So you want to go ahead and run your Minecraft launcher right here. Alright, so once that starts up, we'll click play and then once we click, click play, it will load your world into the game automatically. Just like that. So... So now I'll just maximize this, go to single player, and it's right here. And you can rename that to whatever you want. We'll check it out. And this is the world that I downloaded. It, that I downloaded. I think it's really cool. Um, I think it's really amazing. I think whoever built this put a lot of effort into it. And yeah. And if you want this world save 2 I might put that in the description but anyways that's how to download and open worlds on Minecraft see you guys in the next video